Hi, I'm Deloa Jones and I want to introduce you to our uh, laser table. So over here, this is how you'll get it. It comes in two pieces and you'll get some screw nuts and bolts and you'll get a plastic sheet. You want to find out how wide you need this for your machine. So once, once I find out how wide I need it, then I'm going to put it together by just Let's see, I want it there. So I'm going to put these in and I have a washer and a little nut to put it together. So we have it together. And now I will put this sheet on. I do want to make sure that I'm going to be in the area that I want to with this sheet. So all I'm going to do is see where that laser light is going to hit. And so right here is a really good place to put it. Sticky side down. It would help. And so what's this sheet for? It's just to hold the pattern. Okay, so you'll put the place. pattern under it? Right. Okay, so I'm going to get this metal lion pattern. It's of a tiger, and I'll stick it under the sheet. What's really nice about this um, system is that if you have a really uh, busy fabric and you can't see anything on it, to use the laser light, it doesn't matter that you can't mark the quilt. You can use it over here. Plus, something like this is pretty intricate and it's made to use with the laser light. But I don't like using the laser light on the back. I just don't like yeah. using the back of the machine. Okay, so I wanna place this tiger on my quilt. Let's pretend this is where I wanna center it. So I would put my needle where I wanna center, and then I would move my laser light to the center of the pattern. This is a metal lion pattern, and you can find their patterns online. So now we know that the tiger is centered to where I want it on the quilt. And I'm just going to move over here to the start position, needle up and down. I slowed my machine down just a little bit because I know that th this pattern I'm going to take a little slower to get into the eyes and things like that. So we'll go back up here. I don't have the stitch regulator on, but when I am making a lot of little turns, I'd rather not have it on. If you do have an intermittent stitch on your machine, that's a good thing to put on too when you're making a lot of little turns and want the stitch regulator on. But a lot of the designs you can put the stitch regulator on. I could do this one with the stitch regulator too, just wouldn't go around the little tiny curves as nicely because of the, the length of the stitch. What is nice about designs like this is that you can take them and enlarge them or shrink them on a copy machine to the size of the blocks you want. Coloring books are a great resource. You can modify them for continuous stitching or just use them for the general outline. Then go back later to fill in the detail. You want to make sure to make smooth movements when using the laser light. If you are not exactly on the line when doing the pattern, no one will know. But if it is not smooth, it will not look nice. Is that the whole thing? Yes. Okay, so the reveal. Oh, there you go, my tiger. Alrighty. So, um, what what else can you do with the laser table? Um. You can put stuff on it. <laughs> I want to put drinks on it, but it's also. It's, it's also a good coffee holder. <laughs> I, if you're uh, eating spaghetti and you want to quilt at the same time. <laughs> I can I can lay stuff on it. That's for sure. Uh, it's just really well, nice. Well, and with the sheet, I mean, you could use an Expo marker yeah, and I modify a pattern 
or if you just want to draw something with an expo, you could go with it and then use that too. Right. Yeah. Now, if you don't have both of these bars mm -hmm. and you have a machine that just has this back bar and maybe not a front bar, right? Uh, what you can do is you could take uh, batting or like a roll of, uh, say, a towel, and you can put it on. And as this raises, you'll have to raise this. It needs to lay flat, but it is adjustable enough for a lot of the bigger machines. You can see that there's a lot of holes here in which you can adjust right. how, how wide it can be. And if your machine seems to be longer once you get everything, uh, let me know at sales at Delos Quilt Shop and I'll be able to make you a longer piece and mail it out to you. Um, that's the laser table. That's the laser table. Smile! <laughs>